Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Cordant and here we are once again for some more Baldur's Gate 1. So we were clearing this level of Derlex Tower. There were a lot of caves, a lot of acid, <coughs> rather unpleasant. Yes. And now we're Never hopefully gonna explore me. some safer grounds. Even though <laughs> there's still some acid here <laughs> for Cordant to step through. But yeah, as always, we gotta proceed carefully because of the risk of traps. Ooh, what is this? Weird looking room. Storage? It looks like storage. Okay. Ah. Uh, God damn it, I don't have enough space. Man, I'm gonna be happy when I leave this place and I actually um, clear my inventory because I, I do need it very badly. Ooh, this is interesting. Sorry about that. Okay, <clears throat> we have a staff over here, man. I have so many ward stones in my inventory, it's kind of annoying. Okay, you guys can all get up here. Taking some poison damage along the way, but that's fine. What is your bidding? Hopefully I can clear some stuff. I'm going to need to clear some things here. So this is a, a mere potion of strength. I know I've come to this screen many times and I can never tell what I actually want to throw away. <laughs> but I think I'm just gonna go with these because these are the... I mean... The more generic ones, let's say. <clears throat> that doesn't really do much for me. So, put this there. You now have enough room for one item, and one item only. <laughs> it's kind of annoying. And Vaconia, you could have some room if I wanted to. Okay, nice. So I can give you this. Okay, wonderful. Life is so Corrin can now pick up the stuff. And nothing else. Okay. Let's continue checking for traps. What else is around here? I'm actually considering maybe going back <clears throat> to, let's say, Beragost or something to clear my inventory. Maybe not in a video, just so I wouldn't annoy people. <laughs> not annoy. But so I wouldn't waste uh, time in the video clearing inventory space and all that. But at the same time, uh, if it were me watching a video, I would want to watch such a thing. Um, as boring as it may seem. <laughs> Even if I would skip through some of the steps. Is this not a, a hidden door, really? Okay. So we'll see. If I ever feel the need to go back to town and clear some inventory space, I'll just do it. Okay, carefully. Don't want to step on anything nasty. Okay. So we're safe up until here. <coughs> I'm moving a bit fast now, <laughs> and I may get caught and killed. And that's all because of my lack of patience. There's a room over here. Hmm. Oh! 
This door can only be opened through the use of a special wardstone. Well, we picked one up. Nice. Very nice. So the wardstone from the ghast, the special ghast that we killed earlier, opens up this door. It kind of looks like a treasure room from Durlag, which means <laughs> I'm going to have more stuff to put in my inventory. Ooh, why, why is there a spell symbol here? Interesting. Oh! Oh my god. Palpatine, come here. Wherever fate takes me. Locked. Okay. 72 gold. <laughs> Next to that pile. Come on, man. Oh. Palpatine is gonna be so happy with this. Okay, drop it to the floor. Everything on the floor. Everything on the floor. I should really get rid of some of these um, fire wands. <clears throat> but I'm too stubborn and too much of a hoarder. Yes, all of the gems. What? What is it here? Wonderful. <clears throat> Wonderful. Okay, so let's put these over here. Put the ones over there. This can go over here. Okay, looks good. Now, I'm kind of afraid to touch this. What do you do? Oh no. I should not have done this, should I? Where the hell am I? Okay. What is it now? Time to not take any risks here. <laughs> Shall collapse? May darkness prevail. Okay, slump up. Night singer, give me power. Oh, I already used protection from fear. Okay. Execute order. Now, 66. what the hell is this? There are several stone golems. We came to kill, but not without reasons. We were here before, as were the tentacles. Their underground was near, and the tower intruded on their expansions. As well, as well, <laughs> the bait was too deep, was too great to pass. The dwarves did not hide their wealth did not stop the rumors of waste deep gold. The invaders came and still come, but not without invite. We came to kill, but not without reasons. Okay. Oh God, man. <clears throat> this is the end of things. Here I stood and struck them down as they came. My family and my clan with their false faces. They dropped all pretense and drew their weapons against me. I fought them to the last, killing the shape changers that had taken their forms. I cursed them for destroying the dream, but they were not the real evil. The real evil could not save my people before this de deception. The real evil hid from life in the face of this tragedy. The real evil deserves the blame. This is the end of things. Answer where blame has fallen. Dude, I will not choose now. Yeah, thank you. Oh, God. We crafted as we were told. We built this place to prevent all from entering. We trapped every inch of every step and made sure that to enter meant death. We have killed many over time, though it is not our will. It is all to protect against the repeat of the past. Though the challenges ensure it will repeat. A mountain to climb, a river to cross. Because it is there, they will come. We crafted as we were told. Okay. There was no warning, but it would not have helped. There was no need to prepare for hard times, because hard times would never come. So we were assured, and so we believed. 
The great troll killer was our provider, and he would protect us. We put down our swords to live the life he always wanted. We lived as family. Suspicions were for outsiders. Guards and weapons were for wartime. There was no warning, but it would not have helped. Let me just double check this one here. We came to kill but not without reasons, we were here before as were the tentacles. Their underground was near and the tower intruded on their expansions. As well, the bait was too great to pass, the dwarves did not hide their wealth, did not stop the rumors of waste deep gold. The invaders come and still come, and but not without invite, we came to kill but not without reasons. Okay. So what is the question again? This is the end of all things. Here I stood and struck them down as they came, my family and my clan, with their false faces. They dropped all pretense and drew their weapons against me. I fought them to the last, killing the shape changers that had taken their forms. I cursed them for destroying the dream, but they were not real evil. The real evil could not save my people before this deception. The real evil hid from life in the face of this tragedy. The real evil deserves the blame. This is the end of things. Answer where blame has fallen. Oh God. The blame falls upon the invaders who attacked mercilessly and on your people who could not defend themselves. It falls upon the craftsmen that built this evil place and on you for telling them to. The blame is shared by all in your eyes. The craftsmen encouraged you. I don't think so. The blame begins with the invaders but they attacked with supposed good reason. It could be on your people but they were in the shelter of your confidence. The craftsmen only did their jobs as directed. In your eyes, you are the one to blame for all that has happened. This actually sounds, sounds correct. Your people are without blame because the invaders were unstoppable. The invaders are not to blame because they were fighting for survival. The craftsmen just did their jobs and you could not foresee the attack, so you are free also. None are to blame in your eyes. Mm. I doubt he considers no one to blame. No. The invaders are to blame for the slaughter of your people and should be blamed for the helplessness helplessness they felt. They also contributed to your hiring of the craftsmen, so they are indirectly to blame. No, no, no. I think the correct one is this one. The blame begins with the invaders, but they attacked with supposed good reason. It could be on your people, but they were in the shelter of your confidence. The craftsmen only did their jobs as directed. In your eyes, you are the one to blame for all that has happened. You have understood. You may yet survive where I could not. Okay. Okay. So we are brought once again back here. Uh, oh, okay. But I wanted to explore that section. <laughs> Maybe there's a way over there through here? Let me just quick save this. I remember I like those... <clears throat> those puzzles. It's pretty much a way for you to understand what happened to Durlag. And what happened to, its, to his clan and family. What's over here? Oh, hello. <clears throat> oh, this is the ghost of his wife. Let's just quick save this because this can go wrong. We have a couple of doors and we have a box. Ah, and here we have a hidden door. Perhaps. Come on, please. Yay. God damn it. Oh, you bitchy. <laughs> okay, tell me stuff. <clears throat> you have come far and seen much, but not all would stay. Leaving is what I offer. Irritate the spirit no more. Leave this place and the madness it keeps. The world above is yours. The depths belong to the dead that will not let go. Ah, good spirit, you can send me away from this place. I will accept your offer. Thanks just the same, but I will stay. This could be useful um, if I wanted to go back to town to identify some stuff and sell some stuff and all that. I'm not sure if this works the way I think it does, though. 
The light calls, you do not go. You are as stubborn as my derlag. I will send when you wish, only that I could... Uh, would that I could send the weight from his shoulder thus. Pay some money. Some traps, maybe? Oh! A helmed horror. Um, these are not very hard, but I don't want Corrin to face tank them, so let's just move him back a bit. Yeah, so he's immune to missile weapons, or at least uh, my missile weapons. Vaconia, you can also hit. Myself and Edwin can just chill. Ow. Why are you guys just... <laughs> I'll do it. You can do it. Come on. Atta boy. Execute order 66. Great peril yields great beauty. It does, doesn't it? Okay, this looks like another forge. No, no. Stay here. Stay, stay here. Uh, let's have Kagan tank it. And then attack him. Okay. What did he drop? Not much. Okay. Pew. Oh, he's going for Corrin, as usual. Good job, Baconia. Takes me. Hmm. Okay. One trap detected. So it should be safe up until here. Any more traps? No more traps, it seems. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Okay, cool. Cool. Eh. I think this is just a plus one warhammer. Okay, let's send Edwin up here. Let's let's send everyone up here. Execute order sixty-six. What is it? As directed for now. Edwin can identify some of the stuff here. Come on, I'm full of these? God damn it. Okay, so I guess Vaconia can j Are these plus one bullets? They are. So plus... Uh, normal, plus one, plus two. Yay! Okay. <clears throat> so she can keep those. Um, or actually, I can give her these. And you can keep these. So these go for Kagan, these goes to Chartil. Really Chartil? Are you full on plus two as well? Again, you this is going to be an issue. This is very annoying. Okay, I can take out the plus ones, give them to Corrin maybe. Man, we've come to a point where we're dropping plus one arrows. That's saying something, Jesus. If it bleeds, um, I... <clears throat> so, Chartil, you are going to take so some more plus two. I can give this to Vaconia. These I can keep. I can also keep this, I think. If I must. The darts do not matter. It doesn't say what it is, but I'm pretty sure it's a plus one. Can I can I store this? Okay. So you're over the limit. 
You're over the weight limit, I mean. But I can give this to Vaconia. Potion of strength? Screw you. Um, and I can take back my stuff. So I can take this and this. Overweight, of course. Okay. Man, I think this is a plus one. I hope it's a plus one. Otherwise, I'm going to get sad. Okay, so let's just store the plus one here. In case we ever come back for it. <clears throat> let's take the bullets. Okay, so let's do it like this. Vaconia, you're going to give those back. And give them to Edwin. Equip the normal ones. Everything seems to be fine. Correct? Good. This is fine. That's fine. This is also fine. Okay. And we have got a rule. A wardstone, let's say. I still want to come back here. <clears throat> but let's explore this room. Life is adventure or nothing. Wherever fate takes me. Gonna put your armor on. Still no? Here maybe? Okay, maybe it was for over for over here. Oh god. I I think I vaguely remember suffering here. But it's not that it's trapped. I think there's a way to to traverse this without taking damage. What's over here though? This I don't remember. Execute order sixty-six. Yes. Great peril yields great beauty. Hmm. I think we all deserve a pat on the back. I think we do. We've been doing quite well, actually. Um. Oh, 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 oh. Check for traps first. Pat on the back. What is this? An engine? A small inscription above a small key slot reads Insert bone wardstone here in order to disable rune traps Ah, these runes When you insert the bone wardstone into the machine's key slot You feel the machine hum for a few moments and then quiet down You are sure that something has been turned off Okay, so we already had it Cool, and we turned off these traps Now, as for here, let's be careful Because the ground is scuffed here Maybe that means something? Mm. Ah, I remember this room, okay. Oh no. Okay, figured. Uh, we had been here before. I cleared one trap, I killed one ether cap, and then I, I just moved elsewhere. Okay, so that's that. <clears throat> and now, hopefully, this room now has the... Ah, uh, because the web is thingy. Okay. The statue intones. Any who dare cross the rune carpet shall be struck down. I need Let's an use Kagan for a test. Sure. Yeah, okay, so it's disabled. Nice. I love so, Mr. Like Corrin. Okay, this is trapped. I don't fully understand what what this area is. It's like a small hut. It looks like storage once again. Wait. There's also a spell icon I here. I am disappointed by our lack of progress. Okay. We are progressing. Shut up. <laughs> Let's open this up. Let's open this up. Ooh, this is a mace plus two.
Ah, I don't know what these things are, but they look good. <clears throat> I'm gonna take the shield. Okay, so <clears throat> I want Vakoni to come up, nah. up here. And uh, I'm gonna have to make some room on someone. Okay, yeah, let's right let's actually check something here. <clears throat> I want to see... Nah. Nah. I'm gonna do this the proper way. Okay, so I have more than enough fire wands. So I'm gonna throw this one away. So I have extra room here. So Palpatine, Good. you can take um, this mace plus two. I also have a bunch of wands. God damn it, man. <laughs> this guy and his weight limits are so annoying. Um, I could drop a wand of lightning. I am gonna drop a wand of lightning. Yeah, it's, it's sure. I'm gonna take this stuff just in case it's actually worth something. I don't think it is, but you know. Might as well do it. Take the sling. Okay. So I'm full again. There's a wand of lightning here. Who cares? What is it now? <clears throat> and we can also interact so with this thingy over here. Which I think I'm gonna do. Luck be a lady. Okay, so we're back here. We were the fear made flesh. We came to the home that Derlag built, and we hid in the people that he formed. With tentacles to guide, we poisoned the clan, and the nightmares of Derlag came true. Our masters said they could taste his, his rage even in the air, but always there was the fear behind. We were the fear made flesh, but it was already here. I gotta read this stuff twice. <coughs> okay, so... We were the fear made flesh, we came to the home that Lad built, and we hid in the people deformed. Okay, we tentacles the guy, we poisoned the clan, and the nightmares of Derlek came through. Okay. So it looks like this is the invader statue, this is probably Derlek statue, no, I don't wanna talk. this is a human statue, and this is a dwarf right. statue. We followed Derlek, we were his people, his family. Derlek Troll Killer, son of Bolhur Thunderhax, the Clanless, formed this place with the spoils of a lifetime of adventure. It was majestic in those times, and we took what we needed from the fortune around us. We grew strong and proud, and Derlek felt he finally had a home. We were the future, his family, and if we were lost, then so was he. That was the fear that hid, that was beneath. We followed Derlek, we were his people. Okay, and now the humans? We entrenched this place against all that would come. We built retribution in the tripwires and vengeance in the fireballs. We worked the hatred into every nook and cranny just as he wished, but our actions were guided from elsewhere. The foundation was the fear that it could happen again, and this was to be prevented at all costs. This was the mortar that held them together. We entrenched this place against all that would come. Friend and foe alike. Let's see if I don't mess this up. My father roamed as I and saw much of the world in his time. Well respected he was, but he had no home. At his end, he died in some faraway land with no dwarven kin by his side. I would not allow such to happen to me. I would not follow his steps that far. I would not be dirt like the clanless. This was my fear. Trace the path of this fear and show me you have learned. It began with you and yearning for a home. It grew with your clan as you feared losing them. 
It manifested in the invaders that came, but you fear they ca they're coming already. It became your home and keeps you safe. <clears throat> it began with your clan and your fear of losing them. The craftsmen fortified this place with it and then it manifested in the invaders. Now it haunts you always. It began with your invaders and their threats against you. It grew in your people and thought that more might perish. It festered within you for a while before the craftsmen entrenched this place against it. It was in the craftsmen and the worry that their work could protect you. It was in your people and then in you as you feared that you could not, that you could not protect them. It was then in the invaders that feared your retribution. It became your people and their fear of losing their home. The craftsmen built as best they could, but they were unsure of the quality they delivered. They were frightened invaders? No. It began with you, but it rested mainly in your fear of the invaders. It followed to your people and then to the very walls of this place, which were entrenched by the craftsmen. Hmm. I think this is the right one. Because he feared being alone. Let's see. You know a little more of me. You may yet live. Nice. <laughs> okay, this is cool. This is Cool. Okay, so I'm gonna send my people back over here because I want to explore. Actually, maybe I just need to send Corrin. Uh... Except suffering and pain and not having room in my inventory. Okay. Uh, give me booties. And Man off I go. Adventure or nothing. Wherever Pew! Fate takes me. Okay. Oh god. There's a trap here, isn't there? No, no, it's over here. Wait. Maybe I'm confused. Wait, did I disarm the trap here? I can't take much more of this male imbecility. Chartil, shut up. I think I did. Is there a, a, a hidden door here? One, two, three, four, five, six. If there is, it's not showing. Let's go over here. What is. This? Oops. Okay, so. What is this? An altar? This has nothing though. Or is it a hidden door as well? What? I don't know what this is. It looks like a radiator. Okay. <clears throat> well, I guess there's only one more place to go. Which is over here. Oh, come on. I'll just leave you guys there, okay? Bye bye. I don't think they're gonna follow me all this way, but we'll see. Okay, so Mr. Corrin here can put back his armor, we can switch the booties, and I can take my gear. Okay. Execute. So let's go over here. And over here, I think I can actually <clears throat> see what kind of traps there are. Uh, I mean, no, I'm gonna take Corn the same. I, I shouldn't assume that all traps are web traps. <laughs> because I could send Kagan ahead with the sword uh, Spider's Bane to clear the traps. I am disappointed by our lack well, it's looking progress. more and more like that's the case though. Ooh. Edwin, oh, you have stone skin, but still, let's not let's not get hit. 
Uh, neither. Le leave me alone! What? Astral Face Spider? This is new. I don't want you hitting me. Oh, bitch! She removed my thingy. My my stone skin. I got scared. Sorry. She didn't actually manage to hit anyone, which is kind of cool. Okay, right on time. What the hell was that, man? Four thousand experience. Execute An astral face spider. I didn't even remember that Where enemy existed. <clears throat> okay, sword spider is fine. You don't scare me. And you're dead. Search for traps some more. Ether cap. Which is fine. Great peril yields great beauty. What is this? Face spider. Where is she going? To me. Okay. Kill it. Yes. What is your luck? Be a lady. The wooden structure lies over a deep pit. You cannot tell the exact depth of the pit, but when you toss a pebble into its maw, you don't seem to hear the stone hit the bottom. Okay, so it's a deep pit. <laughs> I get the idea. I think it's mining something, or it looks like it at least. Okay, so nothing over here. And there's a stone golem. And probably this stone golem is going to be the last one of the riddles. There doesn't seem to be a trap. Let's put our armor back on. Oh, there, it's all already on, never mind. <clears throat> Let's speak to him. Questions have I for you. None but kin of clan may pass. State your knowledge of the history. Answer true and the way is clear. Answer false and feel the sorrow. There is no second chance, neither for true nor false. Do you wish to answer now? Perhaps later. The door from this place remains closed until the answers are given. <clears throat> now I'm wait. I'm saying uh, I'll ask later because I want Kagan to try this because if the sorrow is in the form of let's say a lightning bolt to the face, Kagan has more of a buffer. Okay, let's try this now. <clears throat> sure. Pose your questions, Golem. If you count Durlag, son of Bolhur Thunderhax, as your kin, you will know well the family that built this place. The mother of the sons, the matron of the clan. What is her name? She should be Islan. <clears throat> your answer satisfies. Another question remains. Durlag, builder of the home, founder of the clan, has a name not from his father but his own deeds. The tower was built with the fortunes of hordes, but the last name of Durlag came from the fortune of battle. With axe and fire he cleansed the land of beasts he loved to fight, when axe alone would not suffice. I ask the second name of Durlag. Is a troll killer. Your answer satisfies. A question remains. The father of this place formed the clan that fell in times of treachery. False faces claimed the future and clanless became Durlag. This he shared with his own father, a wanderer that lived by the strength of his weapon. The second name of Bolhur is what I ask you. Since most common is all you need for this answer. I mean, it's Thunder Axe, but <clears throat> I think it even says up here. Wait. What? Yeah. Thunder X. Your answer satisfies. Here is the key to what you need. Here is the secret for what comes. 
The bones will walk where flesh cannot. The ward will walk the bones. Excuse me? Here is the secret for what comes. The bones will walk where flesh cannot. The ward will walk the bones. Okay. Okay, so once again, yeah, let's speak <clears throat> to the invader. Why me? It began with us and the masters. The tentacled ones. I, I think that they're talking about mind flares. Maybe. The tentacled ones directed us, directed and we assaulted quietly with cover of night. We took off the weaker first, hiding amidst the children. None saw the arrival, none noticed the insurgents, and none survived the final rise. When Durlag realized the deception, it was too late. His own family sought his life, and he slaughtered their false faces. It began with us, from the west. Oh, so this is the West. <clears throat> now the clan. This is not my face. The invaders came and took my true face, burying it with my body and my comrades. I was among the last, but not the very last, and I saw the horror to come. My child rose against me, though it was no longer my child. It wore her face, but I knew her to be dead. The doppelgangers came from within, and we could not fight ourselves. Better to die than to kill ourselves. What would be left of a man that has, to, that has had to kill his family and himself? I was among the last, but not the very last. We were hired after the battles were done. Durlak called upon us to make his visions true. We did our best, but his visions grew darker and soon we could not see. We waded through his fallen and we waded through his gold. Near the end, we feared for our lives, though not as much as he did. I was never truly sure whether he wished to keep the intruders out or himself in. Both, I'll wager. We were hired after the battles were done, and we did our best. Okay, so let me quickly recheck this. Okay, after the battles... Soon we could not see... They feared for their lives. And here... They took their face. I knew her to be dead. The doppelgangers came from within and we could not fight ourselves. Better to die than to kill ourselves. What would be of a man that, had, that has had to kill his family and himself? Okay, let's hope I, I have enough knowledge for this. With me, it ended. Speak now of my troubles to show you have learned. From where did my pain come? Where did my pain stab home? Where did my pain take root? Where does my pain reside? Speak and show that you understand. <clears throat> oh God, wait. Wait a minute. Okay, so the invaders came from the west. And that's kind of funny because uh, there are only... Only one direction repeats itself and it's west. So, from the west it came and then the south. The south. The east held it next and now it rests in the north. From the west it came and then the south. The west held it again and now it rests in the north. I will not choose yet. <clears throat> okay, so wait. Invaders came from the west and it began with them. Now, if this is west, this is east. If this is east, this is south, and this, this is south, this is north. Okay. I was among the last, but not the very last, and I, as I saw the turret come. Okay, so I guess it began with the invaders. There was a great battle. These were hired after the battles were done. And now it rests within itself. 
So west, south, east, north. God damn it, none of them seems right. From the west it came, right, and then the south, right. Oh no, it's this is, okay. The east held it next and now it rests in the north. You have learned a little, you may yet survive. Yeah, wonderful. Okay, so we're back here. So, <clears throat> what am I? Ah, I'm missing this place. Okay. So be it. I was wondering if I was missing something, but no. Okay, no item was dropped there. Uh, actually, can I? Is this ghost still here? It is. Okay. So let's speak with Mr. Darlag here. Oh, you will survive this place. You understand what built the hate, the fear. Now you must prevent it becoming worse. A creature below, powerful beyond all, you must remove, or it shall make this place its own. Such a fortress, impenetrable if remade in his image. If there is evil to be fought, I will defeat it. This sounds like a paladin, but <laughs> still. I mean, we want to defeat <clears throat> everything in this dungeon, so I'm not going to say no. So let's go. There is always evil to be fought, within and without. Do as you will. will. Uh, do as you will. The way is clear. Follow me. Oh, you could run a little bit faster, man. <laughs> ah, escort quests. Why do you exist? You are the bane of all video games. Okay, so he, he, he should open this pathway here. Yeah, okay, so he did. <clears throat> The door is now Life available. There was a wall here before. Be a lady. Just gonna check for traps. And this should be a tiny area, so I think I can explore it before ending the episode, hope hopefully. <clears throat> okay, so this is open. Oh. Claire Delane. Stop where you are! I have a bow trained on your neck and you'll not live to reach me. Uh, lady? Fire then, and know you have killed the one who would have saved you. Saved? Then you are not part of... You are a bunch of fools just like we were. Turn back now and leave the way you came. And maybe you will live to forget this place. I don't know if I even have the will to do that. <clears throat> what are our options? And who are you? You said you had fellows with you? Where are they now? What happened to you here? I saw signs of another group, but I did not know you had made it this, this far. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> what happened to you here? I saw signs of another group and did not know you had made it this far. We were neither weak nor cowardly. Inexperience and stupidity brought us down. They went ahead while I rested only a moment and I heard their deaths. I heard... I should not have brought such youth to this place. They were willing but could not understand the danger. We can disarm traps and kill simple monsters but through evil. I should not have brought them. And your name? I would know who I'm speaking to. Perhaps they have not all been lost. You should not give hope, hope so easily. Okay, what is your name? Who am I? I'm an idiot who thought I could assault this tower like it was some piss and cobalt warren. You are a like-minded fool then. Best you make your will if you intend to stay. My fellows went forward but a short ways while I rested here after the blow to the head. Dead they are and we will follow. My name is Claire Delane, and I should be dead. Okay, so we ask this. We yet live. Stand aside, coward! <laughs> you must not give up hope. We yet live, and that means all is not lost. Hope? I lost hope when I heard their screams and knew that I could not help. 
I cannot even attempt the creature that is to come. Have you not seen or heard? The worst is that it did not even bother to lift a finger itself. They fought themselves, or monsters sh shaped as such. I suppose it was fitting, given the history of this place. Don't speak to me of hope. My friends are dead. Perhaps you are not up to the task, but I am still here and willing. If they live, perhaps I can save them. You have no idea what is ahead, do you? It's a demon knight. A demon knight. Such a thing is as rare as it is evil. Alone it could destroy all of you, but that's only if it decides you are worthy of the effort. My friends went ahead and challenged it like it was some chambling skeleton, and it laughed at them. It didn't even bother to lift its sword. Such overconfidence will prove to be its downfall. I, I love this one. It will know I am a threat. I will command its respect. <laughs> I would have little to fear face with others like you. God damn it. Such overconfidence will prove its downfall. I assure you, this creature is only as confident as its power warrants. You don't know what happened in there. You don't know. What great magic did it use to defeat your friend so easily? I have heard of such things, but never thought I would be damned enough to see one. The creature was not shy about talking about it, the smug bastard. He's got a mirror of opposition, or something like it. All who glimpse it get duplicated and must fight themselves. If they fail, they die. If they win, they have, they have still killed their likeness. I have heard that it sometimes drives a person mad, but I never thought... There's a slim chance, but I wouldn't survive a second in there. What is this slim chance you speak of? You have already said that you don't think the creature is defeatable. I've had some time to think about it. I couldn't go forward and I couldn't go back the way we came. That thing in there might even know I'm out here. I doubt it cares, but something it said made me think. The mirror of opposition it used must be very powerful. Maybe it's powerful enough to do the same thing to the Demon Knight itself. The legends I've heard is that they have some resistances, but who knows with magic? The rules are not always carved in stone. Hmm. So I should find the mirror and turn it on him? That sounds too easy. I know. I doubt the mirror will be easily accessible, and even if it is, you may be exposed as well. I got a peek at the room and it's not large. Everyone inside may be affected. Well, you roll your dice and you take your chances. Tomorrow be with us, I'll give it a shot. Hmm. Good luck then. I... I'm not going in. I can't. Okay. Okay. A trap. So be it. And here, are, here is the way up. So, there's a trap over here, which we can disarm right now. You know, just to finish up the episode. Great peril yields great beauty. See what's inside. After taking back my armor. <clears throat> Ooh. A cloak. Do I still... Oh, of course. Man, I need... Um, I don't have... Okay, how much does the cloak weigh? Three pounds. I can just... Okay, I, just, I can just give ammunition to, to Kagan. And I can take this. Man, I wish I had the goddamn scroll of identify, but I don't. Man, I'm gonna buy all the scrolls of identification in the in the entire game after this expedition. I tell you that much. Yeah, okay. So yeah. <clears throat> We're gonna end the episode here, which is actually the perfect spot to end it in. We cleared the entire level, we finished the riddles of Derlag. And we have made our way into the final chamber. So, up here is the final fight. I don't remember it all that well. <laughs> but I'm gonna try and keep our run 
deathless. So Palpatine has yet to fall and I hope dearly to keep it that way. I mean, we've gotten so far. Um, so yeah, as always, let's quick save. Let's make our pretty save here. Palpatine 68. And you better stay tuned for the next episode because it's gonna be a nice fight, I hope. <laughs> Uh, it may it may end up with me dying horribly in the very few seconds in the very first few seconds we get in there Let's hope not. So as always guys uh, Thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying your stay here in the channel watching some Baldur's Gate with me If you have any thoughts about the game any questions leave a comment if you want to get notified about future up uploads to the channel feel free to subscribe and I hope to see you all in the next episode for the final fight in Derlex Tower. So, until then, stay safe everyone.